basically means cleanse, toner, moisturize, and primer, right? So first thing you do is cleanse your face. Now, I already washed my face and clean, obviously, but because my face is so dry, so now we have to cleanse again. And I'll be using my, I believe this is called, I draw something, I'll leave the name on the screen. So that you guys can see and if you want to know the liquid i put inside this comments down below so that i'll make a separate video on how to use this what to put inside and what not to, to put inside so first thing is to hydrate the skin by using this to cleanse basically so I personally, I love to use baby wipes that contains aloe vera or vitamin E. Of course, you can use face wipes if that's what you are. It's better out using and this contains aloe vera. Now that this is done, the next step is the tea, which is the toner. Now, you can use my cellar water, you can use any toner of your choice. I'll be using this SAPPSC facial toner from Denny Beauty Empire. And this is what it looks like. Now, this is SAP simply means sunburn acne pimples. BSC means black spots corrector, and this toner works for black spots, pimple, acne, sunburn, you know, all of those skin um, impurities and all of that. So I'll take my clip, my cutting in. Now that we are clean, don't forget to see your ears, your neck, and I will you let it seize for about a minute or two, depending on your environment, so that you allow this to air dry. Like I said, um, I'm inside AC currently, so it's we dry up easily. Right. Now that we are done with the T, which means toner, we will be going in with the M, which means moisturize. Now to moisturize, I'll be using my bed and you see face serum and i'll be using my face cream as well this is exclusive lightning face cream by telling you to get by as well so i'm using these two products and um when you ask me as a dermatologist or anybody that knows about cosmetics or skincare in general they will tell you first thing you want to use is your vitamin c face cream before using moisturizer to lock it in. Then we we'll proceed to using our sunscreen. 
Now you can use any sunscreen of your choice, but I feel like you want to use sunscreen that contains vitamin E and aloe vera gel because these two ingredients and also shea butter. I mean, these three ingredients doesn't give white cast or like the other light green face cream and all of those. I think you just do what works for you and what's best for your skin. If that makes sense. I've seen people use vitamin C face cream or any face cream you know, and they put this thing on their face, the dropper on their face. Please guys, stop doing that because this way you're taking the stuff that is on your face already and putting it back into the whole body, which means you're contaminating the whole body. Rather, what you want to do is take a drop or two or any drop that you want, put it on your palm, then you take it in like this. Now you take your finger. Also, let this stay for like a minute or two until it's dry. Now, before using next thing, anything that you're using on your face, you want it to be fully dried. Not fully, but like 90% to 99% dry before moving to the next face. While waiting for this, let's moisturize our lips. Now that this is this has been sitting for like a minute or two, we go into our face moisturizer and just take this amount or so any amount that works for you depending on how big your face is. Now let this sit for like a minute or two as well. Now a minute or two is your best chance for you to dry. If you are in, a, in an environment that's not as dry as where I am currently, then you can use your fan. You can use your hand fan, something like this, to let your work go faster. That makes sense so if you are um non already but currently i feel like my face is dried up already now it's looking this way because this face cream contains a lot of good stuff and as well as the vitamin c face you know but trust me this is dry my face is just doing basically right now that this is done don't use your um sunscreen now you can skip sunscreen if you are not a fan of sunscreen or i mean you should use sunscreen definitely but like i mean if you want to use makeup because obviously i want to apply makeup and that will be on the next video so don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to my channel turn on the notification bell so that you get notified when i drop those videos after this video i'll be dropping the makeup video next so turn on your notification bell so that that way gets you next like when i drop that video also i made this hair myself and i'll also be dropping the video the link will be in the description box down below i made this ponytail myself as well without the help of sewing machine thing. i did this out of my own weapon or old make brother so I'll be uploading that as well. For so the video, you want to use your sunscreen. Now, as they say, you want to do the third, um, the three finger method. I don't do the three finger method, and that is the truth. I just take, I just 
take as much as I want. Now, because I have a small hand, this can pass as two to three fingers. So we are all done. I know I said you can skip sunscreen. And the reason why I said you can skip sunscreen is because if you are using a primer that contains SPF 50 plus, then you can skip sunscreen. But if you are not, then you definitely need sunscreen, especially if you be stepping on the sun or you be staying on that sun for an hour or more. You definitely need it. But if you are indoor, then you can skip sunscreen. I don't know if that makes sense. So, anyways, guys, this is the end of this video. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for sticking with me. If you are new here, I love welcome to this channel. And if you are not subscriber, I love. Thank you very much for tuning in again. God bless you. I really do appreciate everyone you do. Don't forget to like this video, comment what you want to see next. And like I said, all this, the air, the ponytail. The link will be in the description box down below. Also, the makeup I'm about to do, I'll try my best to leave it in the description box as well. But don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell so I get to be notified each time I post new videos. Like I said, if there's anything you want to do or talk about, let me know in the comments section down below. I'm posting and I'm awarding the makeup of artist 2022. So, trust me, all this time that I just it now you definitely want to use it in your makeup routine. Bye.